All through the security, bags all dropped, our cases were in a good way. Mine was 20 kg, Marcus's was 18 kg, but we're just about to go through the security now. Or do we get like a bacon rock? Do you not fancy one of these? I'm gonna get, get that. One. Should we get those? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get this. And then drinks. Are you getting a caramel frap? I think I might get one of the refresher drinks. <laughs> okay, so we've come to Starbucks. This is our usual routine whenever we come to the airport. It feels so weird. I feel like it hasn't actually felt like it's been that long though. I feel like we're meant to be back. Um, Marcus went for a caramel frap and he's actually said it tastes unreal, haven't you? Definitely what you need right now. Um, so he's got a large one of those, the caramel sauce, that actually looks really good. And then I went for the Cool Lime Refresher, which is what I got the other day, with some strawberry syrup. And it looks a bit different to the other day, but it's still as good. It tastes really, really yum. Definitely recommend getting the strawberry in it. And then we both went for one of the Berry Crunch yogurts. This looks really good. Health is wealth, right? So I'm nearly opted for the bacon roll, but I'm actually feeling this. It looks really nice, so we're going to eat that now. Um, time is... 5.52, we're doing pretty good for time. We actually got through like putting our bags in pretty quick and the security quicker than we thought. It's not actually as busy as we thought. So it's been quite nice so far. So I think I managed to get an airport pick. I'm gonna have a look through them now and maybe edit one, get one ready for upload maybe, but yeah. All okay so far. Feeling good, I'm not feeling too tired actually, are you? No, I'm happy. Okay. I was yawning a lot on the way here, but I feel a bit more refreshed and awake. Well, hopefully our drinks will help us out anyway, but what happened? <laughs> um, we're going to tuck in some breakfast. Cause to our hotel excuse the fact my makeup's gone a bit patchy literally obviously i've been wearing my mask all morning you basically have to wear your mask everywhere so i've been keeping that on so that's why the makeup has fully rubbed off but it's fine because i'm just going to probably take it off in a bit anyway put some sun cream on and go and sunbathe but yeah i just thought i'd chat you through a little bit of how it's been so the flight was absolutely fine pretty much no turbulence we'd saved two love islands to watch on the plane so that literally took up the whole journey caught up on that and yeah made the time go super quick 
so that was really nice the only delays we had was like queuing a little bit to get through the spanish borders so there was like no queuing whatsoever really in the uk airport it was just once we'd come into Spain, they obviously had to check our QR code for our form we'd filled out, which was also like the COVID test. And we just had to go through the passport control, which took a little bit longer. Just a few more queues this side, but it was still fine nevertheless. And then just took a tiny bit of time for us to find our private transfer. But we're here all fine. Really, really warm already. I think it's like 28 degrees. I've just got this little angel crop top on and my shorts from earlier from Boohoo. My whole airport outfit was from Boohoo, by the way. I'll pop a little picture here on screen of my airport outfit. It was really comfy and just good when I got this side because I wasn't too hot. But yes, we've made it to the hotel. So I just thought in true travel vlog style, I have to do a room tour and show you guys the room. It's really nice. Check-in was really easy too. All good so far. So coming through the door on our left, we actually do have a full length mirror. I feel like this is such a lifesaver. I'll be able to obviously see all my outfits in a full length mirror and the lighting's not too bad either actually. So grateful for this and then coming in onto the right is the bathroom again another really big mirror lighting's quite nice we're doing makeup um just a little sink a few complimentaries a kind of close-up mirror hey um a hair dryer useful towels are really nice too and we've also got little complimentary slippers in the dressing gowns i feel like usually i would love that but i think it might be a little bit too hot but it's a nice little touch and then just obviously little toilet and then shower in here looks like it's gonna be quite a nice powerful shower actually so that looks really good so that is the bathroom and then coming through to the main sort of living area we have the bed which looks massive i think this must be like a king size actually just put my case there but i'm probably gonna get some clothes out and put them into the wardrobes they have a really nice wardrobe space with lots of hangers and there's probably some stuff that it's gonna crease if i don't another wardrobe space there with a safe in it and then over here we just have like a desk area tv a kettle which is perfect i can have my teas i brought my tea bags along in here we just got a little fridge which we've already just popped out and just got like a juice some water and we also got some crisps we're going to do another shop soon as well from the yoroski to get some bits but yeah other cases over there nice little chair area here too actually and then we come out onto the balcony the best bit oh the sunshine look at that view i feel like this is the best bit coming on holiday going onto the balcony and just taking it in finally being away is so so nice so yeah here is a little overview of the hotel we have the sea view room so there's like the main strip for the restaurants and the beach is literally right there we're literally like two minutes away and then this is the pool areas at the hotel they also have a rooftop pool up there and i think a bar but yeah it looks so so nice with these pools here the nice palm trees they've got day beds so yeah i think we're just going to go and have a look around the hotel um probably go to the bar get a little bit of bites eat they gave us complimentary drinks so that'll be nice and then i think we're gonna have to get into our swimming costumes and get some bathing into the sun but yeah how gorgeous does that view look oh just so excited to be away so we just come to the Yoroski supermarket just to have a little look around and just see what they've got. I feel like foreign supermarkets are the best. They always have so many good bits. We just love to come and have a look around really. So just checking out the pastry section. Oh, look at these mini croissants. Oh, pan are they pan of chocolates? Or oh, I think they've got cream inside or something. Yeah. They look quite nice. Donut. So yeah, we're going to have a look around, see what goodies we can pick up. Fresh fruit section. Maybe... I feel like I might get some bananas or the watermelon. That looks quite nice. Yeah, should we have? That looks good, doesn't it? I feel like watermelon always reminds me of being on holiday. Maybe we'll get that or some fresh one somewhere, but yeah. Probably some bananas might be a good shout. Let's put out some sweets, this little sweetie bag, and then look, it's like sweet sushi. Those sweets look unreal. Oh, I feel like the little biscuit aisle is so good. Um, are we gonna pick up some like cookies? Maybe some of these. Oh my god, what is that? Just cereal in like a carton. Looks so good. Yeah.
So it's our first dinner out and we've come to this really really nice restaurant on the beachfront. It's like a little pizzeria and our pizzas have just come. I have gone for a vegetarian pizza. Um, I think it has like courgette, mushrooms, um, peppers on it. It looks so yummy. I think they're like properly stone baked as well. And then Marcus, what is yours? Like chicken and barbecue sauce, chicken, barbecue sauce yeah. mozzarella, and but I think it's tomato based with just barbecue sauce on it, but it looks so, so good. So yeah, we're really hungry now. We did have a little nap earlier, but yeah, we've got dinner, just a Coke with our dinner. Then I think we're gonna go for a cocktail after, but it's so, so nice just to be eating on the beachfront. Such a gorgeous evening. So excited to tuck in. Yum. I got a pina colada, like a frozen pina colada. It tastes really, really good. It's like really pineapple-y. Mm. Love the little like cherry on it as well. And then Marcus got a blue lagoon. I think it had like, yeah. Oh, okay, let me try. It is really strong though. I don't know if you'd like it. Yeah, I'm not a fan of too strong. Good though. Mm, I like the fizz to it. Yeah. I think that's the seven up. No, it's not too strong. I quite like that actually. Yeah, yeah, so we got some cocktails. We've come to a really cute little cocktail bar. We've been to a couple of times. It's called Hotel Tropico. Hotel Tropico. We also have a little mini golf here, which is super cute. We're going to do that one day. They have another golf as well, like a big crazy golf course. So we're always going to do that. But yeah, we're just going to enjoy some cocktails on the beach run. So, so nice and just chilled. We just had dinner, which was lovely. But yeah, I'm in this really cute little dress from New Look as well. I'll maybe pop a picture on the screen. I'll show you my OOTD later. But yeah, lovely evening so far. So we are back from dinner. I said I would just do a quick OOTD. So this is the really, really gorgeous dress from New Look. I just love the sleeve detailing, the little neck. I actually put a little bit of like glowy glitter on me today which looks really nice and then I put on these quiz sandals which just have like a tiny little heel so yeah I feel like these are the perfect kind of holiday sandal and then I just had a little misguided bag but yeah this is the first look for the first night the first dinner was lovely we're back relatively early we went for a cocktail as you would have just seen but we were up so early this morning that I feel like we just need a good night's sleep but yeah I'll pick you guys up tomorrow morning good morning guys happy Sunday so we have decided to have a little pool day today it's on the rooftop pool I will just show you a little bit of the view so here is our view for the day the pool looks so nice and yeah we're on the rooftop so we have a really nice view of the beach. Can you see it over there? So, so nice. I think we're just gonna have a bit of a day around the pool, just sunbathing, probably go in the pool, get a bit of lunch, and then we just actually got some pina coladas. Oh my God, it's so yummy. Even got a bit of fresh pineapple on it. Literally one of the best pina coladas I've ever had. It's just really sweet, really cold, refreshing, just a really good drink. So I definitely think we'll probably be getting more of these. Or we also wanted to try the strawberry daiquiri, but they didn't have any at the moment. So we might get one of those later. But it's so nice. I'm in this little swimming costume from Boohoo. Super cute, getting some content as well. So definitely check out my Instagram. But yeah, we're just gonna laze around the pool. I think I might start my book today. So the book I brought with me is called her. It's by Shari Lapina, the one who also writes The Couple Next Door. I'm sure you guys probably have heard of that one. Really good book and I just really like her as an author so I might start that. Listen to some music but yeah, mostly just sunbathe and chill out. So probably pick you guys up later when we either go back to the room or maybe get some lunch or if not later on this evening. But yeah, so nice and chilled. <laughs> had a little bit of lunch and we're gonna go and get another cocktail I think lay by the pool I have quite a lot of like bikini pics to shoot so that is why I've chosen a new bikini guys 
feel like this one's so cute it's also from boohoo love the like marble print it also comes with a little matching top i've just got the skirt on for now i probably will put the top on as well though but yeah how cute is it so we just literally had like a baguette some crisps i might take a banana with me but we've had a nice lunch and now we're gonna get back to the sunshine <laughs> We just went out for dinner. I don't actually think I have mentioned on today's vlog. Today is Sunday the 11th of July, which is actually Marx's 21st, as he tucks into the fruit on his cocktail. It is actually Marx's 21st 21. birthday. Wow. He is 21 today. So we did actually probably celebrate before we came out because I wasn't able to pack all of his presents. So I gave them to him then. Actually, let's show the main present. So got him this gorgeous Gucci necklace. Yep, he is focusing. Um, I just thought that would be quite a nice 21st birthday present something he can remember and it's obviously a really really nice necklace looks so good with all his holiday outfits so yeah we are celebrating today um to put out some little decorations in the room but yeah we've had a really nice day just chilling around the pool sunbathing the dinner we just had was so nice for mains marks had the fish and chips and i had this chicken and chorizo pasta that was lovely and now we have decided to come out for some cocktails to continue on the celebrations i've gone for this malibu i don't know malibu kind of cocktail it's got a bit of pineapple on the top actually and then marcus has the strawberry daiquiri which just had lemon and some nice strawberries on top is it good it. so wicked yeah i've not, not actually tried mine yet so let's taste test mm. good. it's good it's basically what i have all the time but i love that so so nice so mm. drinking those then obviously the football match is on tonight so we're definitely gonna have to watch that football is coming home we're really excited for that yeah that's just what we're doing now thought i'd catch you up if I don't pick up the camera again, then I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. So today is Monday. Happy Monday. I hope everyone is all okay. I hope everyone had a lovely evening last night watching the football. I know the results were not what we wanted, but I'm still proud of England. Nevertheless, I still feel like it was so good. The country coming together for that like celebration. I feel like everyone was in such high spirits. The vibes were so good. We did watch the football, um, yeah, everyone was going crazy over here, but yeah, we had a good evening. Today is Monday, we are up and ready, we've been for breakfast, this morning I did actually have some pancakes, they were really nice, um, and now I've just got ready again today for a beach day, so today I'm in this swimming costume from Shein, I also have a similar one from Shein that I've brought with me, that's another swimsuit, it's kind of like an abstract print as well those were both in my recent Shein video I'll try and link it down below if I remember these were super affordable this one's meant to be a house of CB dupe but it's so cute and yeah the other one's like more like brownie pinky tones but I love the blues and the greens on this one so so cute so I'm wearing this just gonna throw on a little beach cover up and yeah I think we're gonna go and get some bits for the beach and then just spend the day there which I'm super excited for so excited just for another chill day of tanning, getting my tan on, but yeah, just thought I would come on, update you and show you today's swimwear option because I think it's so, so gorgeous. I feel like everyone needs this in their life, especially for the price of it on Shein. So yeah, it's today's attire, beach day for us. Super excited just to chill out again. So yeah, I'll pick you guys up in a bit. So we have made it to the beach, we just went and got some beach bits, I'm just throwing my hair up, it actually looks a little bit crazy. Um, but we got ourselves a lilo each, because there just can't be to lay on at the beach. We got a bat and ball, which we're just about to play, love a bit of bat and ball on holiday, it's so much fun. And then we just got one of these umbrellas with the little thing, obviously to put it into. And then some little food and drink, and then just my beach bag filled with like our book and stuff. But yeah, feeling chilled out. The sea is looking lovely. Lots of nice yachts. It's a little bit cloudy at the moment. The sun's covered by some clouds, but I think it's gonna come out. We've still just sun creamed up, but yeah. We're just gonna have fun and chill at the beach. <laughs> McDonald's and 
then got our McFlurries. We're gonna eat our McFlurries on the beach. I've actually got this Oreo with peanut butter. Just tried it and it tastes unreal. So, so good. They have so many good flavors of McFlurries over here. So, I'm gonna tuck into this whilst sunbathing on the beach. So, at dinner time, we have decided to come for a Thai tonight, which is something a little bit different. I've never been to this place before in Palma Nova, but it looks lovely. And we don't usually really go for Thai, but I've gone for this like Penang curry, just got it with vegetables, you can add I think chicken, beef or prawns. But I've just gone for it with vegetables and then we've got jasmine rice and then Marks has gone for this like sweet and sour dish, I think it's like sweet and sour chicken and beef, also with the rice. But yeah, I'm really really excited to tuck in and try because it looks delicious. So we have come to a little mini golf at the cocktail bar, Marks's turn, we're on number three, sorry. I'll have to go. Oh no, it's rolled yeah, back. It's, it's, it's I was... God, go again. Babe. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> it's give it a camera. bit more. Better. That was better. So, yeah, it's just a little golf course, and then we're going to go for a cocktail after. I will update you at the end who ends up winning, but I'm winning so far. Oh, that was good. Yeah, that's it. No, that's good, that's good. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. That's good. Oh, you want coffee? Nah, you're okay, thank you. Alrighty, thank you. Cheers. Ta-da. Yummy. Is it yummy? Oh, good. Yeah. Bro, yo. ready to have another pool day so as you would have just seen from the clip before i just wanted to show you my kind of like morning skin routine i have been using the products that i did buy specifically for the holiday which was the primark skin tint the primark kind of like blush and also the l'oreal water tint which again is like a tinted moisturizer really really been loving like the skin routine they both have spf in it kind of just gives you a little bit of coverage a bit of a glow just like a nice color to your skin kind of feels like you are wearing a bit of makeup but your skin's still moisturized and also got like the spf in it so yeah really been loving that so that was my skin makeup and then this morning i will just go and show you my outfit in the mirror so today's ootd is this little set from boohoo and then i've got on my my little hat from primark this was literally two pound fifty and this whole set was really affordable too so we've got on the little triangle kind of bikini top and then nice high leg bikini bottoms with this little ruched skirt and then this really cute top over the top really really love that actually and it's just such a pretty set it's like the pastel ombre with the mint green and the baby pink so that is today's ootd with some sliders from primark Feeling cute in this, absolutely love it. Can't wait to snap a little pic for this one for the gram. So I hope you guys have been loving the Instagram content. But yeah, we had breakfast this morning. Now we're just gonna chill around the pool. Probably get the cocktail of the day, which is a strawberry daiquiri from the bar. So I will show you guys that. But yeah, another really chill day. I hope you guys are loving the holiday vlog so far. We're, I don't know if we're halfway through yet. I think we're just about halfway through the week or maybe tomorrow, but yeah, so far loving it. So gonna get my turn on again.
we have come out for dinner and come to this really, really gorgeous place on the seafront again. The sky looks really pretty. It kind of looks pinky. It's gorgeous. Um, yeah, the place looks so nice and they have such a nice menu, a really, really good cocktail menu. So we might have to try out a couple, but the first one I've gone for is a Solero daiquiri. So creamy and it does taste like the ice cream, like a Solero. So, so nice. And then Marcus has gone for, I think it was called like a Caribbean punch or something. But yeah, the cup looks so good. Can I try? That's well good. Do a little taste test. Mm, so like fruity and sweet. And here's mine. Mm, they are so good. And then we are going to be ordering some halloumi fries. And Mark's going to go for a burger. And I'm going to go for like a stir fry. So yeah, dinner is going to be good tonight. Dinner has been served. Here is my sweet chili stir fry and Marx's burger. Looks unreal. Oh my god. So, so excited to eat this. This is just a bit of me. Looks so yummy. To finish off the dinner, we went for a couple more cocktails, but I've got one of the dessert cocktails, which is meant to be like a Toblerone. I think it has like chocolate syrup in it, um, Baileys and some other liqueur, but yeah, it looks so yummy and it tasted it and it's so good, but yeah, it does taste really nice and just chocolatey. There were some other really good ones on the menu too, which I'd love to come back so and try. Yeah, I'll shoot. pop like a me yeah, okay, I'll pop a screenshot of the menu on screen so you guys can see, but yeah, definitely recommend this place. If you come to Mallorca in Palma Nova, let's try and see what it's called. This is what it's called. Screenshot now for recommendation, but yeah, the food and the cocktails has been so, so good. chilled at the beach as you would have seen from the clips this morning had a bit of a beach day and then went back to the pool got an ice cream which is the usual holiday stuff so chilling out but we've now come out for dinner we're coming to a kind of just like american diner tonight which we're really excited about because the menu looks so yummy so i probably will show you the food but i also just thought i would show you a quick ootd because i'm loving the dress that i'm wearing tonight it is from zara That's zara dress like this really gorgeous tie-dye camisole one like ruches at the side uh, pink powder bag and then just these little shoes from Quiz. Excuse the bites on my legs. I feel like I haven't caught a tan, but I've just been a bit um, <laughs> there. Um, but yeah, just out for the night. Okay, our starters are here. We have some really cheesy nachos. These look Um, obviously, I'm sure you guys would have all seen that the Balearic Islands and Ibiza are moving to Amber from Monday. So, we literally just got here in good time. Our week here was literally perfect timing. As I said, we fly back on Saturday. So, goes to Amber on the Monday. So, we're going to be absolutely fine. Not having to quarantine. So, thank God for that. I mean, not that it would have mattered for me because I work from home anyway. But I probably would have been a bit annoying with my boyfriend because he... 
he doesn't work from home but yeah nevertheless we're all fine i just feel so so sorry for the people that have just got here and are either having to book flights home early or are gonna have to now quarantine and also just for the trade out here like the people in the restaurant last night were literally saying we've only been open and like had proper trade for two weeks and it's probably gonna like close down again i just feel really really sorry for all these little businesses the restaurants they literally rely on the tourism out here so yeah i feel so sad for them i think there's a new rule coming in that maybe from the 19th if you've had both jabs you don't have to quarantine from an amber country so hopefully that's going to attract more tourism still but yeah nevertheless we're all okay so yeah we were up this morning had to do our video called test with the brand called collinson then when i got some breakfast and then i've just been lazing around the pool but i just thought i would come up and chat to you guys about today i think we're gonna go and walk down to the beach now um get some lunch and then chill again by the pool and then later on we're going to go to the fun adventure golf they have another big kind of like crazy golf here which is always so fun to do so we're going to do that before dinner but yeah i just wanted to come and check in catch up with you guys let you know what we're up to show you my bikini of the day i'll just go and show you in the mirror so today we have on this i saw it first bikini i've had this for a couple of years i'll try and link something similar if i can find it and then this little beach skirt from boohoo which is fully brand new in so this will definitely be hopefully in stock and then just some classic 90p primark flip-flops so this is the ootd today's bikini honestly i feel like i've never not caught the sun as much as i have on this holiday like i just feel like i'm not catching it at all the only thing i'm getting is bitten a little bit of heat rush on my feet um yeah kind of just looking a bit pale i just feel like i usually would catch the sun more by this point than i have i don't know i don't think i've not not been in the sun as much as usual so don't know what's going on but it's fine i've literally just enjoyed chilling in the sun anyway but yeah this is the outfit we're just about to pop out of the hotel and go and get lunch <laughs> evening guys so we've just come to the main like adventure golf i think it's called like golf fantasia we're on hole i don't six. know six, I six hole six and the heavens have decided to open and it's raining which i feel like is quite unheard of for mallorca i feel like it's only ever rained once when i've been on holiday so this is pretty crazy it's been so warm and then suddenly this rain has just come up from nowhere we kind of didn't expect it because we did see a black cloud coming over us when we were sunbathing earlier but i don't even know if you'll be able to see but we can't really carry on the golf right now because it's literally tipping it down you might be able to see in the little pond i don't think you can tell but yeah it's raining pretty heavy um so we're trying to shield underneath this little tree sorry it's actually doing bits here <laughs> um we're thinking we've got nowhere to rush to be we're going to dinner after this um we've got time to play the golf so we're just chilling under this tree trying to stay a little bit dry we're hoping it's going to pass over and it's just a shower but yeah it's really really heavy like not rain we can play mini golf in right now so yeah just thought i would update you that we're chilling um i will update you as well at the end who wins i think i forgot to update you the other day who won marcus did actually win, I win? yeah I marcus won at oh. the other mini golf so yeah. i win this time but i will keep you updated with that but yeah at the moment it's actually raining and we're chilling under a tree <laughs> hopefully we can resume golf in a minute we have come out for some more cocktails at Tropico. This is our favourite cocktail bar in Palma Nova. We always come here. It's a really good menu. We've tried out a few now. Um, Marcus's new favourite is the Purple Rain. Let's show what it is. It is vodka, blue, however you say that, 7-Up <laughs> and Grenadine. <laughs> Basically this one. So I've tried it as well. It is really, really nice. And then I've got the Coco Rico for after, which is basically like a pina colada, coconut liqueur, white rum, coconut milk, pineapple, and coconut juice. So yeah, I'm double parked at the moment, but <laughs> Max is on to his second. But yeah, cocktails are flowing. And also Marcus did win again at the mini golf. It was 46 and I think mine was 53. Oh, you're gonna say 51, but I think it was 57. Seven difference. Yeah, so yeah. I'm just gonna enjoy my cocktails. So this is how we've decided to come and spend the evening after our cocktails. I have got a Froyo, literally the best thing. Love this one in Mallorca. 
always come to it so so good so it's the frozen yogurt and then i got biscoff chips ahoy and biscoff sauce so good it's just something about froyo that's just so so good i think i might even potentially prefer it to ice cream but yeah gonna tuck into that and then we're gonna catch up on love island we've been keeping up to date we just watch it on the itv hub on my phone but yeah that's how we're gonna spend the rest of the evening watching this and tucking into my froyo Hello guys, happy Friday. So today is our last full day in Mallorca. So sad about it. I feel like the last part of the holiday has gone really, really quick. So for the last full day, we've decided to come to the beach again, probably play some bamboo, go on our lilos in the sea. Um, today I've got on this little swimsuit that is from Primark, really cute. I showed it in my holiday come shop with me. Um, yeah, I really like it. It's just quite flattering. Got this little belt on it, but yeah, it's another really hot day. Need sun cream up, but yeah, it is the last full day. So I'm gonna make the most of it. But yeah, just thought I would come and check in. We'll probably pick you guys up later as just gonna enjoy the last bit of the sunshine. <laughs> So I'm ready for our last meal out. We're going back to one of the places that we went during the week, the one called Barbuda Grill. We really loved it there and the cocktails, so we made a reservation and we're excited for that tonight. So I just thought I would show my last outfit of the night. Absolutely love this dress. So here is the dress, it is from Boohoo. Absolutely love it, it also comes in a midi dress version. It's kind of like a meshy chiffon, has a really nice cut out detail. The straps are even adjustable, so yeah, perfect little dress. I popped on these heels from New Look, and then I'm gonna pair it with my pink Prada bag, but yeah, I've been saving this dress for my last night. I hope I can get a good picture in it, but yeah, really love it. We're about to just go out and eat. Kind of sad that it's our last evening out. I feel like it's gone so, so quick, but yeah, I'm sure I'll bring you guys along at the dinner. <laughs> Here is tonight's dinner setting. So prettily, can't wait to eat, I'm so hungry. We are right on the beachfront as well. Best kind of cocktail, the Solero daiquiri, literally does taste like the ice cream, oh my god. I'm obsessed with these, I need them at home, so good. Starters have arrived, so we got the curried pita bread with the trio of dips and then the halloumi fries which look so good with also like a tomato salsa and a chutney. Oh my god, I'm so excited to tuck in, the cocktails are unreal and I'm so buzzed to be by the seafront. So I've already started tucking in and it was so good but we both got pizzas for Maine, Mark's got chicken and pesto which looks unreal and then I went for a pepperoni but the sun is setting now, it looks so beautiful, not even showing up as good on camera as it is in person but it's just so nice and pinky so so nice to be eating in front of such a gorgeous view for our last night but yeah I'm gonna carry on tucking into my pepperoni pizza. Hey guys today is Saturday, the day we fly home. Oh, 
I feel like going home is a little bit bittersweet sometimes. I kind of excited for my bed to see my family. Just get back for those kind of things. But of course, I also don't want to leave. I don't want to leave the sunshine and just the chill vibes, the holiday vibes. I've just felt so, so grateful on this trip that we've even been able to get away. I really didn't think it was going to happen feel so sad for people that were going to come and the fact it's moving back to amber obviously i know it's for a good reason for the fact that the cases are rising and they are trying to keep everyone safe so yeah i hope things are obviously going to be dying down a bit more soon and some of you guys can get away but hope you still enjoyed living it through my holiday vlog but yeah this morning we just got up at 7 30 i got myself ready we went down to breakfast and we've just been finishing up packing our cases so that's marcus's case mine's over here I'm hoping we haven't added any weight. There's just like a couple of extra things that we've added. So hopefully it won't be too much heavier. But yeah, we've just been packing up this morning. Checking everything's packed away in our room. That we've left everything nicely. So yeah, just been doing that. Then we went down to breakfast, had a bit of food. And then I think we've got about half an hour till we need to go downstairs, check out and get ready for our transfer to pick us up. But yeah, I just thought I would come in, check in this morning. Um, I may do some clips at the airport, if not... This may be me rounding off the vlog, guys. I um, hope you have enjoyed. If you have, please don't forget to smash the thumbs up button. And if you are new here, definitely come subscribe. Let me know what you thought of the first holiday vlog in a while. I love, love, love travel vlogs and just vlogging on holiday. So it was just a must for me to do this and include it on my channel. So I do hope you have enjoyed hope it was somewhat interesting and not too much here and there either way definitely come join my little youtube family smash that thumbs up button leave me a comment down below and again it was a huge thank you from me i can't wait to see you guys soon with a brand new video we're all packed up and ready to go you sad to leave it has been good let's go senses hotel is the hotel which we stayed at Oh, last time looking at the nice view in the bee. Oh, <laughs> Bye to the room. Let's go. My travel home outfit is literally just as basically the same as what I came in. Comfy though, and still cute. Here we go. Whoops. Oh.